still, it's been really nice and, and mm -hmm. sunny, although it's a little warm, but you know, we can handle that. A little warm, a <laughs> little humid, uh, you know, some uh, spotty showers here and there uh, over the course of the week, but overall, a pretty, pretty decent weather. The weather's going to be even better for the weekend. Right now, this is uh, the view through our One Shell Square camera, taking a look at the Mercedes-Benz Superdome. You can see some of, the, some of the haze that we've got this morning, a little bit of fog here and there as well, but the visibility overall anywhere from five to 10 miles across southeast Louisiana. Here's the big picture. Here's the frontal boundary. It stretches across uh, the southeastern part of the country and down into the Gulf of Mexico as well. And so high pressure is taking over our weather here in southeast Louisiana. The circulation around that high, of course, is clockwise. So our winds are out of the north this morning. Let me show you this. I mean, this here's here's a reason why I am New Orleanian. <laughs> as you can see up in parts of the Dakotas, a freeze warning in place until 9 a.m. tomorrow. Rainfall turning to snowfall, turning to rainfall across this region. That's moving into Minnesota. If you headed up in that direction for whatever reason, uh, bring your heavy jacket. You'll probably need it. If you go into the northeast or uh, anywhere along the eastern seaboard, looks like you can expect some rainfall. So bring your umbrella while here in southeast Louisiana, all the rain that's out there is going to continue to move off to the south. We are clearing out very nicely. Some mostly clear skies on the north shore. We've got some cloudy conditions down here on the south shore. And this afternoon, I'm expecting some pretty good weather, some sunshine, a little bit of cloud cover down here on the south shore. Very slight chance we might see a rain drop or two your Saturday morning and Saturday afternoon afternoon are looking pretty nice. Hardly a cloud in the sky. Lots of sunshine, uh, some cool temperatures in the morning, some kind of warm, if not hot temperatures in the afternoon. And then there's another front that's coming through on Sunday. That's going to bring us a reinforcing shot of some dry air. So I think Sunday's going to be a pretty nice day as well. Right now at the airport, cloudy skies, 76 degrees, 91% humidity outside the winds blowing at six miles per hour. Your hour by hour forecast showing you that by noontime, I'm thinking our temperatures in the low 80s for the most part, north and south or lake your highs this afternoon will be in the mid to the upper 80s a sunny and warm day a light breeze with us as well if you headed out to the zephyrs game later on tonight at 7 p.m they're taking on colorado springs once again it's top gun night so bring your wingman it's also fireworks night crawfish bowl taking place out there lots of stuff out of the zephyrs game so mostly clear skies overall mild and nice outside if you headed to watch uh, the green wave take on memphis today looks like about 81 degrees when this game starts saturday about 85 degrees I think they're playing Sunday as well. And if you're going to watch the privateers take on the Lions, some pretty decent weather tonight for that game over in Hammond. The Saturday game is, is at Maestri Field, some sunny and hot conditions then. And for Sunday, the game is back in Hammond, sunny and warm conditions on that day. Here's a look at your seven day forecast. And the great news is that today is looking pretty good. Saturday and Sunday are looking picture perfect. Much cooler air will be with us with the passage of that next cold front on Sunday. And then the rainfall, unfortunately, is back next week, but not until like Tuesday or probably into Wednesday. Not a Susan Isaacson.